Okay, hello YouTubers. I found out the how to do it online anyway. Uh, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your recovery disk, okay, if you made them for Windows Vista on your well this is for HP users, I guess HP only gets cyberlink, so um this is my recovery disk. This is this one. Yeah, look at my fingers, okay? Who gives a shit, alright? I don't want to hear any comments about my fingers. Thank you. Moving on. So, what, what I'm going to show you is how to do it. And it's usually disk one. You're going to have to try different disks. I'm just going to put my slave drive up here. Oh, for fuck's sake, stop. Oh, this mouse is starting to get more annoying than like, hitting on crack. I don't know what the hell is wrong with my drives tonight. The CD's getting stuck in the one on the bottom, the CD's getting stuck in this one, the mouse is getting stuck in it. It's like, ugh. Okay, now. You're gonna have to bear with me because I don't know how to do both on one. So I'm gonna minimize that. So now, hopefully, I'm getting this. I should be monitoring that. I really should. Oh my god, you need to stop. Oh, I forget how Windows 7 works. Okay, so now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to your uh, open folder. Let me see if I'm actually aiming this right. It's a monitor, I'm sorry. Okay. And then what you're gonna do is go to your HP folder. Or, you know, for some people it might be different, but HP. And then you're gonna go to where it says apps. Now you see all these, these are all the pre-installed apps that you had on here. And if you click them, you can actually read what it was. Like this one is Cyberlink. I believe it was power to go. Okay, but first you're gonna want to install the the head the head program, which is Cyberlink DVD Suite or Power Starter. That's like the head program or the head vampire. You know, it decides what works and what doesn't. So anyway, so now what you're gonna do is you're not gonna use this. This is useless. You're gonna go to where it says C R Y S C R or Source. Now you're gonna go all the way down. You see all these little folders? All the way down. And you're gonna look for where it says setup. Okay, I'm trying to hold this back as much as possible, guys. I'm not, you know, trying to be lazy. Uh, okay. Oh, hold on one minute. Okay. So you're gonna right click setup. And then go to properties. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to compatibility. Check this box and make sure it says Windows Vista Service Pack 2. Now this is for those who update to Windows 7. So I suggest just going to Windows Vista Service Pack 2. So anyway, you click OK. And then you double click the setup that you just modified in compatibility mode. And there you go. I hope this has been very helpful to you. And I wish you luck in, in reinstalling your Cyberlink software. This is uh, Skipazoa, and I'm out.